out of my townhouse that I had for my junior year of college and I'm moving into a house because we're adding on another girl for my senior year so um, move out day is Thursday and then kind of like cleaning and organizing on Friday but this Monday Tuesday Wednesday I will be getting ready to move in cleaning the apartment doing the checkout list all of that um, it's gonna be a very busy week I also work Monday through Friday eight to five. I have off Friday morning, so that'll be nice, but so I'm kind of like limited on time and everything, but I'm working from home this week, so on my lunch break and half an hour afternoon break and stuff, I'll be doing things around the apartment. Also, I'm in kayaking uh, this weekend and got so burned. It's so bad. Wear sunscreen, kids. But yeah, anyways, today's Monday. Um, I just started work so I'm going to be doing that for a little while. Gotta protect my eyesight since I stare at a screen for eight hours a day. But um, for lunch, I'm actually meeting an old friend from high school because he's a operations and marketing specialist for um, a shop downtown where I live. And I just kind of want to ask him some questions about what it's like to be an uh, operations marketing specialist because that's something that I would like to do in the future um, after my internship and after I graduate college. So I'm just gonna ask him what his job is like and if he likes it and recommendations and things like that and just to catch up. So I have that for lunch and then on my break I'll be doing things and then after work um, me and my roommates are gonna go pick up some paint. It's a really long explanation but yep today's Monday. I'm having my cold brew doing my morning work and yeah hope you enjoy this video if you do make sure to like it comment down below what year in school you are i will be a senior in the fall which is crazy but yeah um hope you enjoy the video okay update it is now 2 p.m i took my lunch from 1 to 2. i'm just trying to get a sense for as to what i want to do in the future after i graduate in the spring Ugh, since this is my last year growing up is hard yeah so now i'm back um i'm gonna clock back in finish up the work day and I probably will see you guys again on my 30 minute break because I'm gonna use that break to continue packing up everything. So, because I have a lot to take down. Like, I'm so sad because I don't think I can use these anymore because they already were like falling off this year because I used them years prior. I am gonna do my Polaroids again still, but I took a lot this summer, so I'm gonna make it bigger and gonna continue to try and take more Polaroids so I can cover the, the wall more with it. And um, I also have a whole folder of uh, magazine pages that I tore out and I'm gonna like make a magazine page wall. I'll still hang up these. Kind of wanna find like little mirrors that are in like the shape of a moon or sun or something like that that could be fun definitely going to try and cover every part of the wall possible in my new room okay first one came off no tears in the wall can you keep command strips after you use them or are they just like not sticky It's these frames that I'm really scared about because I like, they kept falling when I first moved in and I like had to push them against the wall so many times that I feel like they're just part of the wall now. So hopefully we're in the clear. All right guys, so it's the next day, the 18th of August. 
On my lunch break, I went over to my future house and put away all of the food and stuff from our fridges so we can clean that tonight. And oh my gosh, my tan line is so bad. I picked up sushi for lunch, it was really good. And then now I'm back to work um, in a few minutes. And then on my afternoon break, I am going to be vacuuming all of the cabinets. So that'll be fun. I'm also in the process of packing up my room, which is so sad because I love how it's decorated. So right now I'm gonna start taking down the triangles because I'm just gonna be throwing them away because I don't think they're gonna be sticky enough to continue on to the next place. And you can watch me in fast motion. You guys are barely stabilized on the edge of the top of my TV. Is this safe? Probably not. Yep. I mean, you fell, but you're not broken. <laughs> Let's try that again, but maybe in a safer way. Okay, well, that wall is completely done. God, it looks so weird to like not see anything hung up in my room anymore. Anybody listening, if you're still in school, don't take any year for granted. Like, I feel like I was told that so much, especially like beginning high school. So like, make sure you live up high school because then you're gonna have college. And then in college now, it's like, make sure you live up college because then you're gonna have to work for the rest of your life. And I'm finally realizing that. And I'm definitely going to be that parent that says it to my kids. I probably will get emotional when I see this place with absolutely nothing in it on Friday. But yeah, basically my point that I'm trying to get at here is don't take anything in life for granted, time-wise. I want you to find something to do every day, even if it's something small, something that makes you happy. This went in a completely different direction, but hopefully it was interesting enough for you to listen to. All right. About conspiracies on TV I know the truth and it's so simple Blame it on a stupid impulse Hey guys, um Oh my god, it even echoes in here now because There's nothing in here So it's the next day It's Thursday, move-in day Um, I'm on my break right now But then I'll have to work until about 5 And then at 5 I can pack up my stuff My dad's bringing over a U-Haul My boyfriend's coming to help us move in And then I can officially be moved in too Also, I'm not sure if I ever did a room tour But I'll try and find footage And if not, you know, we'll just do one at the next place Even though this room was like my dream bedroom Anyways Okay, so here... I had like pictures hanging up here in my mirror, took down all of my clothes, brought my racks downstairs. My desk is still here because like I said, I'm working until five. And then I just have like the last of the stuff I need to bring down. <laughs> my bed, which I'm gonna try and bring down the mattress myself. I don't know if this is gonna be a terrible idea or not. I'm sure it's very heavy, but I'm just gonna try it. Uh, and then over here, I, the one thing I still have to do is take down my fairy lights um, that I have hung up around the whole room, but that's the last thing. This was my first college room. Oh, and I need to take down my curtain too, but it's like screwed into the wall, and I'm gonna have my dad do that. I just hung up all of my clothes, and they fit. And then now I just have to put all of like my clothes that are in bins in here because, you know, I have like an endless amount of clothes. And then right now I'm just putting together the shoe rack so I can put it into my closet and then start putting my shoes away. Hello guys, I am just sitting on the porch of my new house that I just moved into. There are a few things I still have to do. Of course, now I start vlogging and now cars start going by. I know this calm before. I still have some packages I ordered on Amazon that are coming in for decorations for my room. And I still have to like put up fairy lights and get some more fake plants and real plants and stuff. And I'm probably going to be doing that throughout this next week, which I will be vlogging. 
so if you want to see the end result of my bedroom which i'm so excited about just stick around subscribe and you can see the next video but yeah it's sunday august 22nd this is the first week living here but the good thing is it has a lot of character and i'm starting to really enjoy it even this like patio is so nice to just sit out on um on a nice day and yeah i actually ended up liking my room more than i thought i would so i'm happy and we're like three or four blocks away from downtown so i can just like go and walk and get a coffee or matcha in the morning if i want and yeah it's just i think it's it's a good senior year house to be to be living in yeah i just did a little bit of light sunday cleaning um, I got some candles going, some mood lights going on. I'm going to start editing this video and get that up and then start my vlog for the next week, for my week in my life. So this is me just coming to wrap up this video and say thank you for staying to the end and thank you for watching and I hope you stick around and subscribe and like the video if you like it. And yeah, I can't wait for the videos to come. It's uh, gonna be a blast. Also, let me know in the comments if you guys want to see a house tour or not. I'm sure you'll like see things in the background of my vlogs and everything, but if you want like an official house tour showing you everything. And yeah, I'm just gonna sit here and edit the video and read and have a good relaxing Sunday. And I hope that you have a great relaxing Sunday, whatever Sunday will be next that you are watching this. But yeah, thanks for watching and I will see you in my next video.